How's it going guys? We are back with another video here and EA dropped it. Finally dropped it. Insane new cards tonight. So here we are. Matt Sundin, Joe Sackick with the Gila Fleur, guys. That is the highlight. 90. Finally, the Gila Fleur they released, guys. And let me tell you, that card looks ridiculous. Literally ridiculous. And then also, if you trade an 18 trade deadline collectible, you can make the 96 overall Matthew Shane, which also looks like a pretty solid card. I'm not going to lie. Uh, so that, and then we got Prime Times released. 94 Burns, 97 McDavid. Uh, he got a Prime Time, but he also got suspended. <laughs> so Justin Williams, 86, got Chenya, Corey Schneider for his first shutout in like forever. Literally, as a Devils fan, I can tell you that. He hasn't got a shutout in literally forever. Uh, and that's pretty much it. We got the Team of the Week still out, the trade deadline cards, still a stadium series. And guys, let's look at this card. The Gila Fleur specifically looks absolutely ridiculous. So here we go, boys. Let's go over to it. So Montreal Canadiens alumni, of course. And here we go, loading up. Hopefully it doesn't take 10 years like it usually does. And here we are, okay. Guy Lafleur, guys, 96 overall Guy Lafleur. This card is an end game card. 99 speed, 99 slap shot accuracy, 97 power. Wrist shot accuracy of 99, power of 99, guys. This card will probably go for at least 2 million because his shot is going to be so high all year. Like, you can say the team of the year and everything like that, but it's very hard to top this card. It really, really is. The synergies, S, the beauty, and for the boys, it's the synergies aren't even bad either. You have two, te two team synergies, so that's really not bad at all. Uh, obviously not a center, so his face-offs aren't good, but besides that, uh, the only bad stat I'd say is a shot blocking, and really that's not that important of a, of a thing to have for a winger, of course, so... Is Gila Fleur, guys, it really does live up to the hype. Um, everyone knew it was going to be, of course, a really high overall card, and everyone knew uh, it's going to be, everyone knows it's going to be a good card if you try it, because the 85 overall performed so good for everybody, and people still use the 85 Gila Fleur, and I respect it, because that card does perform really well. I assume, unfortunately, I never got the chance to use it, because I actually chose Peter Forsberg as my legend when you start hot, so yeah, not really the best, uh, best idea there for me, but... It's okay. We got the Guy Lafleur potentially coming to me now. I would hope. 96 overall. I'm going to try to pick that up for a reasonable amount. I'd spend 2 mil on it. I wouldn't spend much more than that, though. That is crazy talk, in my opinion. All right. So, and then, guys, 96 Matthew Shane. Here he is. Got the beauty, BM, face-off master, clutch player. Really not bad at all. This card is a very, very good one. It's really right up there with the Forsberg, I'd say. Uh, I know it's 96, the Forsberg's 97, but, like, there's really not much of a drop-off, I'd say. Shots just, you know, just as high, essentially. The face-offs are 91, so you really don't lose much if you want to play them on center. Uh, but this card is really, really good. I like that they released another high-end card. I mean, I feel like with the trade deadline, you kind of might as well just go all out and actually make some of the trade players, traded players high overalls. I don't see why not, because... I mean, at the end of the day, I mean, do I want an 88 Duchesne? You know, just give me give me a high overall Duchesne that's actually usable. Because at the end of the day, I mean, yeah, people are going to buy the, the 88 Duchesne, you know, if there was one. But at the end of the day, 96, like, he deserves it. Why not? Duchesne plays so well in every NHL, in every hut, every year, essentially. So, really, why not? And, uh, yeah, I mean, that's really pretty much it, guys. I mean, it's be definitely been a fun day for me. The stream today on Twitch was absolutely unreal. You guys know, if you had that stream, how ridiculous it was. Obviously, follow the Twitch, guys, as always. 14 Henrique TV is what it is on Twitch. But yeah, that's really what it comes down to, you guys. Thanks for watching the video, as always. Leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new to the channel, and I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, healing. Okay, okay. I don't know what he goes for. Probably not a lot. 87 overall, but we're not team of the week. All right, I thought it was something better than that, but you know what? We'll take it. Tell me something. Please. Oh, that's not bad. We'll take that! Low key! Be you! I mean, not bad! It's a nice little card to mess around with. That's and he gains the zone. Shoots one. Score! And this one is tied! Puck loose. Couldn't get through. Moved along and in. What a, he scores! Three straight goals! 